Hey, what's up guys? Here's a very cool tip a know-how because you might get stuck to this kind of problem later on. I never thought that one day I'm going to get into this kind of scenario. So one of my colleagues gave me a number of pages that I need to process, but the problem is they do not have a soft copy with these papers and uh, it's, it's around 50 pages. The number one choice you have to re-encode all of the contents of this one through your computer, yeah, it will take time to encode these pages of paper. I came up with a solution and it's very easy. So what we need is our phone so that we can take pictures of the pages of this paper. Then by those images that we captured, we are going to convert it into text file. Now for the sake of this demo, we're going to do two pages. After taking pictures of both pages, locate that picture. Then we get to share this one, upload it to my Google Drive. Well, if you have a phone cable, you can use that one to transfer those files. In my case, I only have my internet. I do not have a cable. I'll just name this one as P1, then save, get into the next page or the next picture because we got two pictures. I'll go there, share this one again, upload it to my Google Drive, then P2. Okay, done. Save. Then it will upload. Let's go ahead and verify it on our Google Drive app to make sure that it is uploaded. So you can see there it's still uploading. The first one is done. Then the second one is done. Let's get into my laptop and that's where we're going to continue and show you how we're going to do it. So I'll just open up, jump into my Google Drive app so that you can see. There you go. Then the two pictures or the images that we have should be here. There you go, the P1 and the P2. So both of them are images. The thing that we're going to do is go ahead and right click this image and then open with Google Docs. Now this will take like um, 15 to around 20 seconds, I guess, to process this one and scrape out all those texts, convert it to a text file. Ta-da! So the first image you can see here is the image we have. And then just below here are the text file that it read through those image. So you can see the full contents of the page. Now you can delete this image and go ahead and continue editing those files. So if you try to compare chapter one, example one dash two, they're exactly the same. Let's go ahead and open up the page two if we can have the same results. So again, this will take around, yeah, I think that was a bit shorter, around five to 10 seconds earlier. So let's just wait for a bit. Then it's loading up. Okay, that's the image again. Then as you can see, chapter 19 on the picture, and then there you go, all the contents. So that would make your life a bit easier if you went into my scenario. Now, like what I've said, if you're going to ed edit this one, then you can just go ahead and delete the image and you have all the contents, the, the text files, the text contents, okay? So I hope you have learned something from this video, guys. And um, hope to see you in my next video. Help me make a dream of 100,000 subscribers. Once again, this is me, Pro, and I thank you for watching. Goodbye.